Oi boys, welcome, welcome to another video on the channel. We are back with season two of our Canterbury Bankstown Bulldogs playthrough. Alright, let's wrap up the year and take a look at some player movements. So what we want to do is chuck it on the league specific. We don't really care about anything else. I guess two, the NRL should do the trick. And here we go. Now pay no mind to the ages. We're heading into year two and there's 11 players here that's already cracked a 90 overall. Pretty crazy. Uh, that's why I always lower player overalls to, I guess, combat how ridiculously fast players develop instead of going through each club. Let's just uh, take a look here. Cam Murray at 93 overall. I mean, I could get with that. He's leaving the Bunnies to go to the Cowboys. Oh, we've got Nico Hines here, 92, heading to the Dragons. That's interesting. Zach Lomax at 92, heading to the Eels. we got Latrell Mitchell heading to the Cowboys as well. It's looking like there'll be a problem in this upcoming season. Far into the Roosters, Argola to the Panthers, a 91 overall. That's that is ridiculous. As is Jake Avarillo with a 90. Herbie Farnworth heading to the Warriors. Quickly Giesen, our big signing, Mitch Moses. Oh, but we do have some Cowboys departing to make room. Ruben Cotter, Gonskis, who else from the Cowboys? Taulangi, Tom Dearden heading to the Knights. Brimos coming to the Dogs. As is Nick Meany. Here's all our departees, if you will. Our boys, we made plenty of room to bring in AJ Brimson and Mitchell Moses specifically. And what I might do this season is try like a, it's like a mid-season trade using the mods. It can be done, but I'd have to, I guess, make it make sense because we're pretty heavy on outside backs in particular. And I reckon I should uh, get rid of a few to make room for a big bopper. But yeah, that's pretty much all the movement within the league. Uh, what we'll do is we'll play the World Club Challenge. We will be skipping the nines and we'll jump straight into the regular season. When it comes to the Super League, I typically never touch it when I start a new career mode. But the next NRL team we play with, they will be updated because our boy Dwarf Boy 101, aka Finn, has been putting in work and he's decreased the overalls for all the Super League teams. They used to be on par with the NRL talents, but now they're like, uh, they're, they're where they should be. If you saw my roster's video, you would have seen there's not many players that's over 80 or mid 80s even. But yeah, before we get into it, as always, if you do enjoy the content, don't forget to run a straight at that like button. Honestly, I think we're better off just going for fins instead of the old steamrolling run. Nope, <laughs> we still get smashed. Bit of a rough one to start the day here. Only 30 meters gained. Kicking from well inside our 40. Not much distance. Oh, get him. And it's Ryan Hall on the return. He's taking that to the house. I thought we could cover him with Brimo. But I guess we pushed too far to the left. What a start from Leeds. A couple big hits. And they try on their first set. Regardless of the stat differential, uh, they should put up a fight. They always do. Especially on Legend. The Dolphins, they put up a fight. They actually almost beat us. And it was the Batley Bulldogs. Oof, the pickpocket. 22-24 was the final score. You just never know. As we try and get Moses through. We have given him the keys to the castle for this game. He'll be the goal kicker. He'll be our general play kicker. It's a beautiful ball. Drawing pass to the Fox. We'll scoot here from Brimo. Man, this is... I can't wait to get these boys in the NRL. Moses, Brimson, even Meany on the wing, you would have seen a knock on. Nice. You hardly see that. A knock on off the grubber. No sidestep for Burton. Down by six. Can we get our first points of the day as he comes back behind the rock? That's Vitala Mariner. Second. Oof. Ladies. And we lose the ball. That's tough. Let's see if we can get another pick. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but if you do rush up off the line when you're short and play the lane, you can actually get an interception. So it's typically the winger, right? So the trick is to actually change before. That's a nice run. Oh, but they, they hand it right back. Marshall King, let's try and find space here. Oh, they get in the way. I want Karaz getting over that white line. But yeah, that interception trick. We are kind of sussed out during our run of Samoa in the World Cup. We've got plenty of interceptions with Brian Tuttle. 
in particular. It's funny because I was trying to get interceptions off Steve Crichton. Plenty of space for Brimo. Test the speed here, thrown back in field. There was a touch and a penalty. Let's go. It's time to cook, baby. Lining up to the right. Moses. Jackson gets it moving. Alamotti taken back into the field of play. Look like we're over. Pangai Jr. to Josh Jackson, the early dive. Just throws his body over the line. Good luck stopping that. That was just a straight up kamikaze dive from Josh Jackson. Caught a bit of knees to the sternum too for his troubles. Burton on the right to Brimson. Nice head from Alamotti. I could get used to this. Alamotti in the centers. Seems pretty strong. Another penalty. One more. You heard it there from the ref. One more and they're off. Jacko. Oh, Jacko. Takes it to the house. What is this? What kind of try is this? We just sprinted. Straight to the gap. What even happened here? Speed. You never associate speed with Josh Jackson. Look at this. The laziness from the from the rhinos there. Let's Jackson straight through. A double for the vet. Let's go, Moses. No power. We make a break instead. Oh, what an interception. The one hand grab. I think we're offside anyway. I saw an orange. Or a yellow circle. <laughs> He's just trying to get on side. That boy was running for his life. Last play. Ooh, a high tackle. That's a coach killer. Although, I don't mind this. I don't mind giving away the two. We can uh, hold on to that little four point lead for the moment. Nice set so far. Oof, Alamotti. Off the big hit. We went hunting. And we got one, baby. We got one. Poor Alamotti. Added dummy half now in the fend from the youngster. That boy wants that center position. Pangai Jr. at first receiver. Draws in two. And Burton pins his ears back. Into the corner we go for try number three. Alamotti. Thanks to Alamotti for, first of all, the big hits. And then the break through the middle of the field. Alright, time to bring in the starters. That whole front row can come in. Actually, talking it. We're going to put him in the back row. Marshall King can come back in. We've got to swap him out there. With 12 minutes left, we should be safe. <coughs> Beautiful interception. We're definitely good now. That's a nice ball. Oh, kill And the footwork from Burton. We have to try and score because it's been a pretty a weak second half. Marshall King oddly goes to Talpane, who's back underneath him. Two plays. Burton. Wide. Tomo finds Mitchell Moses. Let's go left and come back to the right. Back to Burton. King running in behind his own player. Last play. I'll try kick for our other playmaker. That can come off. Man, this <laughs> this half has been an absolute stinker. Oh, the clearance. Oof. That's tough. <laughs> Beautiful. We'll get another crack at the line. With a few minutes left. The reset. There's the space. For Brimo. Alright, four minutes. Moses. To Karaz. Couldn't get one today, but... Uh, Karaz... We'll get plenty of opportunities on that left center come the regular season. Kamai Jr., the same player we scored with. Help. Fox is taken. Let him go. Let him go. He's held. Keep this moving. Oh, man. Hold the Boys have gone to sleep here. Brimo to Thompson. 
Jackson, there we go. A nice little pass puts Alamotti through unscathed. A well-deserved try for the boy, Paul Alamotti, who had a pretty hectic game here. Actually showed out. First time starting at center. There he is, Matt Burton. Adds another trophy to the trophy cabinet for the Bulldogs. The plan moving forward for this Bulldogs career mode, we will be aiming for two games per episode, two 18 minute games, so the vids may be a tad bit longer, we'll see how it goes though, and we'll talk about the um, the trades in the next episode, we'll try and work something out to make it somewhat realistic, but yeah for the moment boys, we're going to wrap it up there, as always, if you enjoyed that and would like to see more rugby league related content, or more content in general, be sure to sub to the channel, and don't forget to run the shoot at that like button, thanks for tuning in, and I'll see you, you. Stay until we pay so going Later. Give me that I want the smoke, I don't care if you broke going Give me that Don't talk in the smoke, watch me hit him with it